Yo guys, what is up? It is Elijah here, back with another video. And in this video, I have something interesting to show you guys. So yes, Clan War Leaks has started, and we will have to go to battle soon. But, if you take a look at this war here, we just came off of, we actually won the war, 80 to 80, but we won by destruction points. Looks like that is 94 to 93. Yes, we were, and th this is why this is such a big win, because we were down by literally like 30 stars. I don't know, it was like 50 to 20 something like that, and we came back to win, or it might have been like 40 to 10. So yeah, that th I, I honestly say this is a crazy win, a big win too against a level 10 clan, and we are a level 8 clan, so hopefully our clan can build off that win as you guys can see. I'm using my Town Hall 8 army to get some trophies back up because I kind of have been farming because I want to grow in this game. And I can't really upgrade any troops or spells right now because I got the miners upgrading right now. So yeah, so I will be attacking with that army. And maybe at least once in this video. So let's take a look at some of the war attacks. Okay, so we are here with the number one base from the other clan. And it's a Town Hall 13. Some of his walls are high level, or most of them are. Got that Eagle Artillery. Got that new defense that came in the game recently. So we're going to be looking at this war attack to see how good it is. Because it's our one of our best players, King Gilgamesh, attacking this base. So we're going to see he starts with the Electro Drag Army. And starting with some dragons. And there goes the Eagle Artillery ready to try to attack his troops. But he, got, he kind of has the dragons spread out. As you guys can see, he, this is actually a good army to use. So, like, it goes from dragons and then you stop using dragons for a little bit. And then once you get to this level, you kind of start ha having to use dragons again. Because they really get you somewhere as that town hall goes down. And this is just a replay, though. And he's going to try to go to knock down that eagle artillery. He's already at a two-star 56% now. 59% two-star. And... He's not he didn't not he did not get the 100%. He got around 2 star 60% as his final dragon or his grand wardens just about to go down it won't be enough to get down that it wouldn't be enough to go get down that gold mine and he was left off with a 63% 2 star. That was honestly a great attack right there on that Town Hall 13 base. So good job, King Gilgamesh. Let's look at the next war attack. So we are back here with the next base. This is another Town Hall 13 base, it appears. And this guy, who was it? King Gilgamesh got like a two star 87% on this base. So we're gonna watch this attack as well on the number two base and we're just looking at the top two attacks in this war because they're usually the best and the reason why we came back in this war is because of some of the great attacks so he's using the electro dragon dragon army again or whatever that army is called i don't know if there's a name for it i don't know much about the good players as armies but the Eagle Artillery is going to start attacking his troops, and he's hitting this base quickly. He's already about to get the two-star. He already got the Town Hall down. I'm telling you guys, this army is great once you're at this level. Just by looking at it, I haven't used it myself, but just by looking at this army, it looks great. And he is really hitting this base hard. Those That Electro Drag is working hard, but... It really wasn't enough to get the 100%. Still a great attack, though, as his Electro Drags are going down. He still has one more remaining, and he still has the Grand Warden working, trying to beat out that Eagle Artillery, and it won't be enough. And that Electro Drag's going down. He has one more Dragon working on the side, but it obviously won't be enough. For, it wouldn't be enough for the 100%. 
And King Gilgamesh, oh, yes, one more dragon. But King Gilgamesh, or whatever how you pronounce his name, was left with a two star 87%. Another great attack by our number one attacker, King Gilgamesh, attacking number one and two. Great army, great strategy. And yeah, thanks to his attacks, they were a big reason why we came back to win this war. So I will be attacking with my, we can say, Town Hall 8 army base. And hopefully the bases are easier. I'm just doing this for fun. And it was a good army. I used it somewhat through Town Hall 9 too. Or maybe through the whole time I was Town Hall 9. But I will be back with you guys once I find a base to attack. So it looks like that will be this attack. Valkyrie about to go down and gets the gold storage though. And I'm left off with an 84% two star. Not a bad attack for like a Town Hall 8 base army. Honestly, that's not a bad attack. 84% two star. That's great guys as we're going to be moving on. And yeah, so a good attack there by the army. So to just end off the video, guys, I will be doing a builder base attack. And um, so it looks like I am upgrading my cannon cart to level 13. And I got the mult somebody to um, decide what sh I should upgrade. And it was the multi-mortar if you guys were on my last live stream. Oh, gamer dog. <laughs> and um, so we're here at the base. Ready to attack. And my dog just needs to shut up as down goes the wall breakers. And so 
As you guys can see, the Giants go down and it left an opening for my troops to come down into the base. So that's great. Good strategy there. Good job by the wall breakers to actually not go for something pointless and to go for something that will turn out to be useful for my attack. But the troops are actually going around. So down go the giants down the side. I don't know if this will be enough to go to the town hall. But Luda, you had one job just to get to the town hall or builder hall or whatever it's called. Cannon carts, they're going down. Sorry, if you hear my dog, he really needs to shut up. And so cannon carts are going down. This attack did not turn out how I wanted it to be, but there's actually still hope to get the one star 50%, believe it or not. If I can get this archer tower down and then the wall breaker can go down and get that elixir storage, as you guys can see on the side. So we're currently sitting at a 45 or 48% as the archer tower goes down, but the barbarians are going to chase after my wall breaker and that will be the attack. So there will be no clutch today. 48% no star and of course I lost. Of course I did. So if you guys enjoyed this video, smash that like button. Do not forget to subscribe to this channel. Turn on notifications so you guys do not miss a video or a live stream. And I thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any comments, leave some comments down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.